Welcome. Our goal today is to convert a Pine script from TradeView into a MetaTrader 5 indicator. Now, there are a lot of different indicators that are in the Pine script library for TradeView that are unique and that MetaTrader does not have inside their default application. So it's really interesting how you could find different indicators and do the conversions both ways. So we can convert from Pine script to MetaTrader 5 or vice versa. So it allows you to have many options out there in the market where you convert indicators from different platforms into the platform you want to use it in. So this tutorial will be based on using ChatGPT to make these conversions. Now we're in the TradeView website, actually the French TradeView website, which is the same as the American website. I've converted it to English. This is an indicator that has multiple EAs. You can see what it looks like here in the PineScript TradeView platform. You can read through this a little bit, see how it works. So, since this indicator is not in the MetaTrader 5 library or the default library, let's take this script and create an MT5 indicator. Now, the script is right here, and what you need to do is just click here and copy it. Now, open up a blank notepad and paste it into the notepad. Stay until the end of this video to learn how to access our free prompts for trading strategies to use on ChatGPT. Now that you've pasted in the notepad, the next thing we want to do is actually add our prompts for ChatGPT so it can do the right conversion. I've already pre-written these prompts. You can find them in a link below the video. Okay, so we're in our notepad and I'm going to go to the top of this. I'm going to paste in the prompts that I've written. You can read through these prompts. You copy the notepad instead of doing it directly in ChatGPT. You can copy the whole thing and paste it right into ChatGPT directly. We're going to do that now. You can see here the code that we've pasted into our notepad. I'm going to edit. I'm going to select all. I'm going to edit and copy. And I'm going to go to ChatGPT, which is right here. I'm going to click my mouse in the middle there and do a paste or a control V on Windows. Click this up arrow. You'll see how quickly it created the script. You can scan through it to check it out, giving you all the values that MetaTrader uses, which is definitely different from the Pine script. So let's wait till the end. And then after that, we'll be able to copy it into the MetaTrader application. Okay, at the end of the code, there's an explanation of what it did. In this case, indicator buffers, handles, errors, plotting colors, and so on. This script is compatible with MT5. It uses only MT5 for computations and rendering. So what we do here is we're going to scroll up and you'll see where it says copy code. Click there, copy the code. And now let's take it to the MetaTrader application, which I started right here. Now, in the MetaTrader application, we're going to click our mouse in the middle of the screen. Hit F4 and you should see file. Click on new file. Click on custom indicator. Click next. Let's paste the name of the indicator, multiple EMA indicator. Click next. Finish. Everything in here. Select all. Delete. We're going to paste the code. After you've done that, hit the compile button compiles no errors. So the next step is actually go back into the MetaTrader application, which is right here. Let's put the indicator on the chart, make sure it works. You can see the inputs are here, the colors, visualization, common, click OK. And you'll see it has created the indicator exactly like the trade view. Let's go back to trade view and take a look to compare it. And there you go. Very similar to the trade view being used on Bitcoin here. So that wraps it up. Thanks for watching and have fun making your conversions.
Your AI-powered journey starts now. Learn how to create automated trading strategies without coding. Get our exclusive expert advisor consultant course now. Don't miss out on this opportunity. Click the link below this video and check it out.